Hello, I'm Mrs. Khan, uh, part of the Southeast English Department, and I am going to give you a series of videos that will show you how to complete many of the common tasks or reading and writing strategies that we use here at Southeast. So to begin with, uh, we're going to use this same uh, short story for all of the examples. And right now with this video, I'm going to read it aloud for those people who like to listen and follow along. So we're going to use the short story, Geraldo, No Last Name, by Sandra Cisneros. And if you do not want to uh, have the audio, you can mute me, that's totally fine. Geraldo, No Last Name, by Sandra Cisneros. She met him at a dance, pretty too and young. Said he worked in a restaurant, but she can't remember which one. Geraldo, that's all. Green pants and Saturday shirt. Geraldo, that's what he told her. And how was she to know she'd be the last one to see him alive? An accident, don't you know? Hit and run. Marin, she goes to all those dances. Uptown, Logan, Embassy, Palmer, Aragon, Fontana, the Manor. She likes to dance. She knows how to do cambayas and salsas and rancheras even. And he was just someone she danced with. Somebody she met that night. That's right. That's the story. That's what she said again and again. Once to the hospital people and twice to the police. No address, no name, nothing in his pockets. Ain't it a shame? Only Marin can't explain why it mattered. The hours and hours for somebody she didn't even know. The hospital emergency room? Nobody but an intern working all alone. And maybe if the surgeon would have come, maybe if he hadn't lost so much blood, if the surgeon had only come, they would know who to notify and where. But what difference does it make? He wasn't anything to her. He wasn't her boyfriend or anything like that. Just another brazier who didn't speak English. Just another wetback. You know the kind, the ones who always look ashamed. And what was she doing out at 3 a.m. anyway? Marin, who was sent home with her coat and some aspirin. How does she explain? She met him at a dance. Geraldo in his shiny shirt and green pants. Geraldo going to a dance. She meant, what does it matter? They never saw the kitchenettes. They never knew about the two room flats and sleeping rooms he rented, the weekly money orders he sent home, the currency exchange, how could they? His name was Geraldo and his home is in another country. The ones he left behind are far away. Will wonder, shrug, remember. Geraldo, he went north. We never heard from him again. All right, we're going to use a short story for the reading strategies and the videos that continue. I'll see you again soon.